Every system design involves trade-offs, but when I try to understand what I need to discuss, I often encounter terms like scalability or complexity, flexibility or simplicity, etc. I get it, but how do I use this knowledge in my interview? Let me show you an example for a front-end system design interview. Let's take Pinterest for example. The main feature here is a messenger layout. Imagine you are in an interview and your task is to design a front-end for it. Just to say the main feature isn't enough. What should you say? We are dealing with a messenger layout that uses images of various sizes. It's important to explain how you would implement this. There are two main approaches using CSS and JavaScript. CSS solution has such advantages. Simple to implement, leads to faster loading times, responsive design and better browser performance. From another side, less flexible, issues with the order of items and struggles with dynamic content. Using CSS columns and red layouts with multiple columns, but might result in uneven heights. CSS flatbooks might have alignment challenges. This JavaScript solution will receive highly customizable, allows for precise placement of items, can adjust layouts dynamically, and offers consistency across browsers. From another side, it requires more setup time and slow downloading times, may impact performance, and would have compatibility issues. JavaScript is often preferred, but CSS can be a good choice, especially for mobile. In every front-end system design interview, such trade-offs are common. Consider the feature of Infinity's role in a news feed. Would you use intersection of the role or a scroll event handler? What are the pros and cons? When discussing component design, trade-offs appear again. For instance, with a data table, should you use offset-based or cursor-based pagination. Each choice has its own advantages and disadvantages. So, always remember to discuss trade-offs in your system design interviews. I hope you now understand what a trade-off is and how to talk about it. Thank you and see you. Bye.